Hi everyone, this is Tanya here with the Memory Lane Keepsakes and welcome back to my channel. As you guys know, my videos are made for adults who are 18 years and older, so thank you so much for respecting that. Today I am back with a Michaels haul. I want to go ahead and share some of the things that I picked up. And these are some items that I actually went in the store for that I was running super low on. So one of the things I got that I definitely needed was this rubber cement glue. I used my 60% coupon on this because I wanted the big bottle. And I ended up paying only about three forty dollars for it, which wasn't too bad. Um, this glue is one of my favorite glues that I use a lot, especially with the major project that I have going on. This glue will remain in my craft room because I'm using this and only this because I love the way it adheres to your paper. This rubber cement glue is great for no wrinkles when you're mounting um, cardstock or any photos or different things to your um, chipboard or any other thing that you want to adhere it to and it's forgiven in case you place it in the wrong place you have a little bit of time to move it and that's what I love about this glue so I had to get some of that because I was totally out I got some um, new cardstock paper that I did not have in my collection as well as some that I was totally low on that I consistently use in my space so I picked up some of the rose gold paper here so these are the cardstock sheets that are 65 pound eight and a half by 11 25 sheets in this pack here because of the specialty quality of the paper so I got two packs of the rose gold I also got this one here which is the copper foil and I also got some gold foil and all those only have 25 sheets in it and this one right here is a multi primary foil color and you get your red your orange your gold or actually your yellow your green and your blue so those are the ones that I picked up there for my specialties paper. And then the other one I got was the Nostalgia, which I absolutely love. I got two packs of that one because I use the um, different neutral colors here, the natural colors like the browns and the creams for my Prima dolls um, to get the um, beautiful complexion for my dolls. So I use those and this is one of my secrets that I'm giving you one of my tips there. But this is the paper stack that I use that I get a lot of um wonderful crafters asking me how do you get your prima dolls that color and sometimes i do color them myself with my prima color markers or my spectrum markers but a lot of times i use a nostalgia um car stock paper so i got two packs of that and i'm always low and i always have to keep in stock on my white that's a must have in my collection because i run through a lot of white for my clients as well as personal use and then my black is another popular one that's in my um, room that I use a lot of. So those are colors I have to keep because I consistently use those colors. And while I was in there, to my surprise, they had a lot of wonderful deals and things going on that particular day. And this really caught me um, by surprise, but I found some awesome, awesome buttons. I hardly ever go to the sewing section, but I'm getting more into a lot of different projects now where I'm having to go over that section a lot now and I was really shocked to see that it had marked down all their buttons so all the buttons I'm about to share with you were on clearance so hopefully you'll be able to find them at your location now the buttons that I'm about to share with you all the ones with the blue label were $1.97 that was the clearance price for those and the other ones that in the white package were $2.37 each so let's get started so I found these right here and I want to say that they retail for about $4.99 or $5.99 a piece for the buttons I found the cupcake buttons these right here have six pieces in them awesome cupcakes and you guys already know why I got the cupcakes <laughs> for one I love the sweet treats and second my baby always says cake cake so those had to come home with me I have a lot of projects in mind for those and then I found these cute ones right here um, which were these vegetables and I thought this would be great for a scene that I'm working on. So I picked those up. So we have some cabbage in there, some beets, and we have a eggplant, a tomato, pepper, and carrot. So I thought that was really, really adorable. Then I got these ladybugs because we just um, entered into spring and I thought these would be really cool to have in my collection to add some flower projects. And it also has some flower buttons in there as well. Now even though these are buttons, you don't necessarily have to use them as buttons. Another idea for you is you can take off the little um, button area, clip that off, and you can use that as embellishments for some of your projects. So that's the tip right there. And I also got the bacon um, buttons as well. This one right here has a few different accessories inside of it that I really love as far as anything bacon related. Really, really nice. 
got these cute adorable teddy bears really adorable so all of the blue pack ones were a really really great deal i thought that was a great price at $1.97 a piece now all of these are the 237 packs all of these are disney related so i found these right here which are super super cute so it has mickey and minnie in there one with the bow one without of course and those are your red black and white ones and it has a little glitter shine to it i found this one right here that has the three mickeys in three different um, positions there as well as the mini mouse so you can kind of see those really really adorable and last but not least i got these right here which are super cute it has the disney castle in the background it has a mickey and mini ice cream cone as well as mini and mickey um, with a pair of shades on and then just the hats itself i thought these would be great to add to some bows that i plan on making for my daughters and that's the back of them there really really awesome price so i picked all those up now i'm gonna shift those off to the side now i was really shocked to see these items right here while i was in there i haven't been to michael's in so long they actually marked down one of the sections um, which i love to look at from time to time but i would buy like one thing at a time and using a coupon this particular day i did not have to do that this is the jane davenport um, items that I had already shared with you guys on my Instagram page, which is Memory Lane Keepsakes 2017. So make sure you look back so you can kind of scan through and see those photos that I posted up a few weeks ago. So you can see some of the things that they had on clearance because I did not buy everything they had on clearance. I only got what I knew for sure that I would use. And they had some awesome things. Now I did share some journals. I did not buy the journals, but I did get the charms to make my own journals. Um, cause that's something that I did not have so I can complete some projects that I'm working on. Um, so go back and look at that and that's on my Instagram page. And this is one of the things that I did purchase. Um, this right here is acrylic stamp set. This was retail for $5.99. I got it for $1.97. Beautiful stamp set. Absolutely love Jane Davenport line. So many awesome, beautiful girls. I love the, her detail to design and just everything about it. But this is so super cute. In addition to that, here are the charms that I picked up. This is one of the charms here. These, I want to say they were $4.99 or either $6.99, but I got it for $1.97. And it, you can use it with the Butterfly Effect book. That's the book I did not buy. You can still use these to create your own if you choose to. But the charm was so super cute along with these extra bands. I just knew that this would be a great thing to add to be able to create some of my own books. Um, so this one right here is a beautiful charm set. And then I also picked up, in addition to that one, they had plenty of these. I got this one right here. So I only got one of each. And that's another charm with those three colors there, as you can see. So those are absolutely beautiful. And those are my charms there. I also picked up this right here, which is a journal jacket. And on the journal jacket, it says, it's not about the destination. It's about the journal. And this right here actually retail for $3.99, got it for $1.47, which was really, really cool. And it's probably going to be too much to open this, and it is a seal, so we're not going to waste time with that. But I read you um, what the message pretty much says on the journal, so you guys know what a jacket is. And that's that. And then I was really surprised and shocked to see this. I'm so happy they had this. Um, this right here is a splat mat by Jane Davenport. It's that beautiful mat that has the girl face on the front. Really, really gorgeous. Now, this retails for over $30 in the store at original price. Guys, you're not going to believe this. This was $9.97 on clearance. And they had a lot of these as well. So I did pick this up. And it says that you can use this mat as an ink palette. So that's what I plan on using it for to mix some different inks and different things. And I know I have my Tim Holtz board here as well as my other glass board. But why not add a little cuteness to your craft space? Because this place makes me happy. <laughs> so I went ahead and got this here. So really, really adorable. Let me know how you guys are enjoying your splat mat. I've seen a few different reviews. But again, those are one of those projects that, you know, everyone has their own opinion about. So I would say, you know, have to try it out to kind of see what you think. And I'm going to do the same thing here. All right, my last two items, well, actually four. I got four more things to share with you. Two more Jane Davenport and two more um, other goodies. So I also picked up this right here, which is the metallic acrylic paint set. Now they did have um, 
some other colors they had another kit that had i want to say that had your blues your greens and your yellow and a red one in i did not get that one i got the metallic because i knew i love using dark colors for my car stock like my blacks and i knew these colors right here would complement my um black car stock really really well to add some extra detail to whatever i'm creating but included in this beautiful awesome acrylic paint set you also got a stencil in addition a jane davenport paintbrush which is really really awesome so these are some different things on the back that they kind of did with the um acrylic box set here so that's really really neat and i didn't pay a lot for this either i want to say this right here might have been like 6.97 or something like that and i think it originally was like 15. so that was not bad at all so i got those and then i also picked up and I was really happy about this. I think this right here, I want to say that this retail for um, 25, I think it was either 15 or 25. I got this for 497. So I was really happy about that. This is the Jane Davenport pencil cup. And as you can see, it's the it's a beautiful face and you can play some of your Jane Davenport um, essentials um, that you are tools that you use in your craft space or any other tools that you choose to use and dress up your face any way you choose to like on here she's kind of showing you an example how she's placed some of the um, beautiful acrylic roses um, on the ears for earrings and also she's made up the face with a little bit of makeup there and placed a flower in some of her different um, color essentials inside of the pencil jar and so this is what it looks like on the side so you can get a better look i'm not going to take it out the box but inside it is um already uh, painted for you it meant let me see here on the back it says that the it's a um, glazed interior so the inside of your jar has a glazed interior so that's really really awesome so that's already painted for you but this was a absolute great find i'm really happy that i got this to add to my craft space nothing but cuteness there and last but not least i'm going to share with you the last things i picked up these were on clearance these are some backpacks that i found and every year we buy the girls backpacks because by the time the end of the year come they're pretty much um their backpacks need some tlc so these were um by imagine eight is the brand and these retail normally for $19.99 a piece these are called canvas backpacks and this one right here i got for myself this black one here because i'm going to um, pretty much make it my own and do something with my cricut and add a beautiful design to this right here i got some things in mind for this I'm trying to decide if i'm gonna do quotes if i'm gonna do faces or a little bit of both but this is mine and it has um, a great amount of pockets so you have your zipper area here it also zips up from the side right here and then you also have pockets right here and right here so it has a great amount of storage in the inside of this bag so this is the black one this right here was $11.97 on clearance which was absolutely a great price it also came in a canvas color and a green color as well and I got my girls I got them each a bag I got them the denim one so it also comes in denim so it comes four different ways so this is their denim one here which i thought was great and it'll look good and stylish every day for their fashion since they wear a lot of blue jeans and they dress up from time to time in skirts and dresses but this i thought was really really cute because i can put their favorite quote or a special positive message on the front here um you know just to make some one's day so that is my clearance so this is my haul showing you my jane davenport as well as some of the things i went into the store to grab and i'm really really excited that i had a chance to um, get some of these great finds i hope you guys have enjoyed my video and this is tanya here with memory lane keepsakes don't forget to subscribe give this video a thumbs up as well as comment down below and don't forget to check out my instagram page which is memory lane keepsakes 2017 all my social media information will be in the description box and you guys have a great day Talk to you later and be safe out there. Bye-bye.